Hello everyone, welcome to my Let's Play Let's Play series episode 10. Today, we're going to work on a way of powering our quarry, and as you may have seen from previous episodes and what I just made, iron tank walls. Yes, this 9x9 is going to become a tank. And not any tank specifically, uh, not just any tank, an iron tank, and it's going to be one big one. One majorly big one. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and begin with this. And we may not necessarily even get to finish it today, the tank, but uh yeah, okay, so we need to go down one, two, three, four. So yeah, this, uh, give me some time, I'm going to clear up most of this area, and I'll talk to you guys here in a minute. As you can see, we have a 9x9, nine nine that is 4 deep, and I'm going to go ahead and explain a little bit about iron tanks right now. now iron tanks are a multi-block structure from Railcraft. <clears throat> Railcraft is a mod that allows, that has to do with rails, okay? Let's get more into uh, multi-block structures. Multi-block structures are structures that require multi blocks to become an object in the world see like and it'll make more sense once when we get it but uh with iron tanks you can make a variety of sizes you have three by three five by five and seven by seven and there's a king uh, config option for nine by nine and that is what i'm gonna make here now iron tank can either be four through eight one of those two. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and make an eight one, which means we need to go down again. So I got some more clearing out to do. A lot more. So I'll talk to you guys when it's done. Okay, so I just finished digging the hole. So that is nine by nine by eight feet deep. Or about eight blocks deep. <clears throat> so we're gonna go ahead and uh, just lay in the bottom layer real quick, just to see how much resources this is gonna take. This is gonna be a lot, like a lot. Or just plain Jane, a lot, like probably more than should okay so with 36 blocks as we laid that and then now we're gonna need to begin that mm. let's go ahead and dig up the coal okay so now that we know how big this needs to be. I'm going to go ahead and break this all back up again. Just so that way. I don't know. I'd just rather have it broke up than being laid in the bottom. And then after this, we're going to work on a fermenter. So let's go ahead and make a fermenter now. Now a fermenter is made out of bronze and a whole bunch of bronze, okay. So let's just go ahead and make a whole bunch. So it requires <clears throat> four bronze gears. With four bronze gears, a lot of bronze. Okay. Start off by making one of these. Then. 
I'm guessing bronze gears are made by a stone gear and bronze. Put the bronze on the corners, dirty machine, and I'm guessing glass. Could we put somewhere? If I left it down somewhere, I'm going to be pissed. I'll leave it in here. Come on, glass. Show your face. Yep, I lost all my glass. Okay, that's not good. Uh, I think I know where I left it at. If I go on these mining things, I run out of inventory space, so I always leave it here. Really need to make some of those like miners and diggers backpack. Do that. Yeah, that's what we're gonna go ahead and do pretty soon. Okay, that's full. Glass, bronze, stone, sand. Oh, saltos. There's my saltos. Okay. So let's go back up again. Alright, I'll uh, see you guys when we're back at the base. Okay, so I just got done checking the bees. <clears throat> Made some gl uh, Got my glass. Fermenter. And then I'm also going to need some biogas engines. Whoa. Your biomass engine. Bio gas. Yeah, er, got bio. Is it biogas? Yeah, it is biogas. Well, I feel like an idiot now. Okay, so guess what? More bronze. How much bronze to be exact? Okay, so I need three plus oh, so eleven times three. So thirty-three. I might run out of copper. I ran out of copper. And of course this one's full. Oh. Just go ahead and make these real quick. How do I make a piston? Hmm. Okay, so yeah. Wood. Cobblestone. Let's say redstone and iron. Iron. Redstone. Put the wood right there. Wood, redstone, redstone, 
Why is my I need to I know how to fix my mouse. Great, now it works. I've always fixed my mouse. It's always worked too. Okay, biogas engine. Oh crap. I pushed the wrong button. I pushed the wrong button. Okay. Almost froze the game there. So I'm in a better gas engine, and I'm guessing I need to go mon mining again on the copper layer. For how much though, I do not know, so I'll come back in a little bit. So after copper mining and getting nothing, I soon realized that uh, it requires diamonds to make a logger. And it requires diamonds to make uh, a sugarcane thing. And, well, that's it. So, um, yep, I'm just going to go ahead and do a lot of tree farming and get a ton of saplings stored up. So I made a little tree farm here. And, yeah, we're just going to be tree farming for quite a bit. So, um... Talk to you guys after I get some saplings stored up. Okay, so I just got a whole bunch of oak saplings. Yay! Woohoo! And we're going to sleep over the night, so my beasts start working. And I got, uh, I believe, like two, and I guess fourth stacks of wood. Or oh, fourth and a little more. Mm. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and you know saw those up, and then we're gonna put. I need to get some more capsules first, but yeah, we're gonna place down the fermenter and begin working on biogas. And I want to make uh what's it called? I can't think of it. Fermenter biogas. To make a fermenter fertilizer. We want to make fertilizer. Which I'm guessing we're going to need appetite and sand for. And I got appetite. There it is. It's the sand I'm worried about. Okay. So I am going to go mine some sand and I'll be back to you guys here in a second. So I think I got a wax capsule now. So let's go ahead and make this up. Let's see if that's one biogas worth. Nope. Hmm. 
So let's make some more. Hmm. Almost. There we go. Fire gas. Woohoo! Yeah. Go buy gas. Fire gas. Yeah. Woohoo! Buy a gas. Buy okay. So now we can start running the quarry almost. We are going to need some storage places. Which is why we made so many chests. I guess. Because <clears throat> we are going to need a lot of places to store this stuff at. Yep, let's just make a whole bunch of chests on us to gun. This is not going to be the most sorry, efficient sorting system at first, but it's going to work, hopefully. And then now we're going to need some land markers. So, okay, so I'm going to finish making my uh, land markers in the next ep episode, and I'll catch you guys later. And my keyboard's stuck again. Okay, so I just got a whole bunch of sand. I got quite a bit, probably more than I needed. But hey, you can never have too much sand, I'm guessing. Mm. Then I want to check these apiaries real quick, see if they got any honeycombs in them. And I'm guessing they don't. So, go back to the overworld. And make a crap ton of fertilizer. I'm going to plop the fermenter down right there. Throw some fertilizer. And smoke saplings in there. And I'm guessing that we're gonna need some water too. I am just going to go ahead and fill this thing up. I want to see how much one um, sapling gets me. So again, I guess I gotta fill this thing up manually because I don't have an Oculus accumulator built quite yet. Okay. Now we got a whole bunch of wood and a whole bunch of that, that stuff. So yeah. <clears throat> so 
So we're going to make some, some compress all this. And then cook that stuff up. And it turns out we got some more iron panels. Probably more than we needed, but oh well. I guess it never hurts to have a little too much. And we need to get some beeswax. So. That way we can store our biograss we are making. And come. Ah, oh, we just need one more. So I guess I'll come back when this is in the full operation. <laughs> 